All right, Halos, welcome back. How's everyone doing? All right, it's been a quick minute since I've played, but uh, we're back at it once again. Uh, I believe previous. Oh. Are we fighting a dragon or something? What's happening? Hold up. Yup, there's a dragon. Freaking dude pulled out his bow. I was like, wait a second, what's something happening? Where's this dragon? Is he over here? Let's find out. I do have Whirlwind Sprint equipped this time, so that's good. Um, is he flying around or is he over? Oh. Here he is. Fight me. That yep, that hurt. <laughs> Alright, let's see if he'll come over here. I really don't want him fighting the town. If I can avoid it, he'll come and fight me on open ground here. That'd be good. Bandit here as well. Alright, I'll go ahead and grab her stuff because why not? She was right here. And we can sell some of this for sure. Um, I guess I'll grab the iron arrows, but I don't really want it. Where is he? Oh, he's still in the air. Okay, there we go. Nice. Nice, we got a little bit more damage on him at least, so that's good. Where is my shield? Here it is, yep. I want to try to... It won't block magic damage, but if I can block his attacks, that would be useful. Some some defense at least. Okay, he's gonna use his breath attack here. Nice. Good stuff. Get some block upgraded if we can. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Do we get some help from someone else? Or was it just us two? Because we were kind of wrecking him. Not gonna lie. Good job, Lydia. All right. Well, let's take all of his loot real fast, and we can sell some of this stuff and use it. Some of it we'll pack away for later. Um, Sweet, awesome, good stuff. Uh, you know what, I will take the iron dagger for now. Uh, we'll drop it if we need the space, but yeah, sweet. Get another dragon soul for free. That's, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, let's go ahead and get Muffle back equipped once again, so we can just keep leveling that up. Nice, nice. Alright, so what we were doing previously is recover the Elder Scrolls, so what we want to do is uh, go down and transcribe the lexicon as well. These are both going to be uh, down in, I think it said Mazulft, or was it, um, what was it somewhere else? Let's see, right here, offhand is where we're going to head in from it looks like. So yeah, alright, cool. Oh, looks like we got some enemies over here, let's go ahead and get some sneak attacks in, level up some other stuff. Some bonus damage while we're at it. Might be able to get him before he even gets here. Yeah, there we go. Let's see if we can get a sneak attack damage on here. It doesn't look like it's really giving us the bonus, at least not on the top left. Okay, he's detect us now for sure. So we're good. That's fine now. Good stuff, good stuff. I'll go ahead and take their stuff because it's uh, alchemical ingredients. Uh, other than that, we should be good. Let's go ahead and heal up a little bit more, and then we'll also re-equip our muffle. Um, I took the goat hide there. I don't know if I needed to, but I did. All right, how close are we to this place? Still got a little bit of ways to go. It looks like it's a little bit upped. We have a location here that we can discover, but I don't want to head in and clear it just yet. I want to do the main, main quest a little bit more. Oh yeah, this is this place. Okay, I should be able to discover it by walking over here somewhere. There we go, Sarthal, cool. That is actually part of a different quest that is, um, what you call it, um, part of the College of Winterhold quest, so we'll definitely do some stuff there. Oh, hello. What is fighting up here? Got a little cinematic takedown there. Alright, definitely take that and then let's continue on. Should be able to cast Muffle pretty soon here. Go ahead and get another couple snow berries, because why not? There we go. And then let's continue on our way pretty much. Uh, yeah, let's do it, let's do it. 
Should be right over here somewhere soon, so shouldn't be much farther. It's actually like we're still in combat in terms of the music, but I don't see any enemies, so I think it might just be glitched, I don't know. Hopefully it'll reset upon doing something. <laughs> Got some wolves over here. Looks like they heard me shout, probably. Nice. Good shot, Lydia. Go ahead and heal up a little bit more here and then bring a quick muffle. Oh, what the heck? We do have a buddy here. I'm gonna get some two-handed leveled ups, but let me cast Muffle once more. Whenever it'll let me. There we go. Alright. Nice, there we go, perfect. And then, do I have any two- oh wait, I might not even have any two-handed weapons. <laughs> I didn't even think about that, actually. That's fine. There we go, nice. Got, him. Got a little block increase there as well, which is nice. Lydia doing a lot of damage actually. Might have to take some of her arrows <laughs> so that she won't just like kill people from a distance really easily. It's alright though, it's just. I would like to get as much. Oh! Hello? Spriggan down here, what are you doing? I will take the goat hide for now, actually. You know what? Uh, we didn't contract anything there, did we? Sometimes those guys give you, like, rock joint disease or something. Doesn't look like we did, though, so that's good. I kind of want to grab this, uh, this dragon area thing real fast, because it's a shout. That's where we need to go right there. You can actually see it from here. But let me go see... I think we killed the dragon for this already. That's the guy that was flying around. Uh, if not, we'd get an extra dragon soul, that's that's great as well. But I think we killed him. And so we might as well just grab this shot real fast. Oh no, we did not. Okay, never mind. My mistake. back around and grab that. So we're out of stamina because I was sprinting a little bit too much, but that's okay. Uh, let me head up to this place so we can get it. It's back down here. Is he gonna bite us? Oh, no, he's using his breath attack. Okay. Alright, alright. Go ahead and search this stuff. Oh, that's interesting. Looks like he used like a ranged ice breath attack there. Right, let's go ahead and get this uh, this shout real fast. Nice, good stuff, good stuff. Oh, he used the breath attack again. All right, never mind. My attacks are not hitting him right now, which is kind of funny. There we go, now they're hitting him for sure. Restoration increase, that's awesome. There we go, got him. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright, cool. And then we'll re-equip muffle here as well. Go ahead and take his dragon scales and bones. Don't need the sword. Uh, we might have to give the scales and bones to Lydia pretty soon here. 
but I don't know, we'll be fine. I think there's a chest somewhere around here. I can't remember exactly where though. I feel like it is over here somewhere in like a little shack or something. Or maybe I'm mistaken. Can't remember. It doesn't look like it's over here. Is it down here somewhere maybe? Level up, nice. Lucian increased. Alright, well I'm not sure where that the big chest is that usually is there, but that's fine. At least we cleared that, so uh, we don't really have to go back there, although if we want to get more souls, uh, they'll, the dragons will eventually respawn there. After a little bit of time... Oh, we did miss that iron over there, I forgot about, but that's fine. Let's go ahead and grab this Corenda more, but actually let me, before I do that, let me do some more muffle. So that that is regenerating while I'm, uh, I'm mining the vein. A little bit of efficiency there. Nice, nice. I'd like to make these uh, videos longer as well. The um, I saw someone comment that they enjoy the longer videos, and I was like, yeah, I mean, I, I enjoy making them five of the time. Uh, previously, I hadn't been just because of not really having all that much, much extra time to do things, such as like editing and such, which is why I don't do a ton of that. But um, yeah. Oh, hello. Some people doing stuff over there. I'm not worried about them though, to be honest. Um, but yeah, anyways, uh, that's why I hadn't made longer videos. But I'm honestly thinking about it again, possibly. I don't know though. We'll see. We'll have to see. Uh, anyways, we got another level up, so that's good. Uh, let's go. I think we'll go health. We could definitely get be a little bit more tanky. Uh, I'm not sure. We're not worried about the conjuration stuff. I do remember we got restoration up a little bit. So um, this one needs 60. Okay, that one's really good, and this one's also super nice as well. Um, so I would like both of those, honestly. This is also super nice, but that's a 40, so we can't really do a whole lot there right now. Uh, enchanting, we probably could do more, yeah, we definitely can, but I'm not super worried about enchanting yet. Until we get 100, level 100 enchanting, uh, which won't take very long, honestly. Um, it's going to be a little bit on the back banner burner item again, so, unfortunately, I guess. Um, that's nice. There we go. This is what I want. That's level 50, though, so it's going to be a little bit longer before we get that. This one's level 60, and then we are using mostly swords, so we could do the critical damage one if we wanted. Um, yeah, honestly, I might, but let me just check out the other stuff real fast. I need one more point for archery. Light armor and heavy armor wouldn't be bad. Sneak, we still need points in, so that's not really not going to do much for us right now. Lock picking, nice, but not really necessary. Speech is pretty nice. That's one of the things I was working on, actually. Maybe that's what we'll do. This is 60, 60, 60. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think what I'm going to do is do speech, actually. Uh, because I want to get some of these higher things right over here. So we can sell people more stuff, basically. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. So we'll go, we'll go one point in this for now, and then that'll unlock the next level, and we can start keep going up from there. All right, cool. Let's check and see if there's anything of use in some of these like abandoned little shacks here. Uh, oh, hello, Ex expedition manifest. Okay, let's read this. Uh, how long is it? Two pages. We can do it real quick. We've managed to secure the site and hold off any others who may try to steal our discoveries so far, especially those from the College of Winterhold who seem to think the glory of exploring every ruin should be theirs alone. The crew for our expedition is as follows. Sola Trebatius, myself, uh, expedition leader. Umana, my constant companion and bodyguard. Vali, or Valier, a mage not associated with Winterhold, took some time to find. Indrast, a fellow explorer of some local renown, Yag, I think, a great brute of a woman, hired to keep the rest of the labor in check, Jadar and Jassar, two Khajiit brothers hired as labor. Those sound familiar. I feel like we actually find them down there. Alright, um, 
Need a couple more laborers. Getting through the ice is proving difficult. We've set up shelter and scouted the area. The small ruins on the lower plateau of the glacier don't seem connected to the main structure, and we haven't managed to find a way into the uh, tower parapet we've found here. Yag mentioned spotting a fissure in the glacial wall that may lead into the ruins, so we are going to try to find a way to get down there with the gear. Looks like a storm is coming. Okay, yeah, I definitely remember where that area, area is, actually, uh, funnily enough, so... Alright, cool. Uh, let's unlock the chest real fast. Maybe somewhere over here. Oops. That's fine. I know there's a mod that actually, like, leaves the lockpick in the previous place where it broke. And that's super useful, actually. <laughs> I might do that once I do, like, a... Not modded playthrough, but, like, you know, a playthrough that's not just straight up vanilla. Just like some some added things, but nothing that's gonna like break the game or anything. Dang, some stuff happened here for sure. Can I sleep in here? Oh, nice, good. I was actually wanting to, because then we get that bonus, the rested bonus, which is super nice, actually. All right, um, so we got a bunch of other stuff here. I don't think it's gonna let us get straight into here, right? I think we have to go down. Uh, but let me just double check, because that's what pretty much what the the thing was saying there. Yeah, we can't. All right. We can clip through the wall, but that'd be cheating. Alright, uh, oh, is this a lighthouse or something? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, let's head down here and see what we've got. Pretty sure we're gonna find the two Khajiit brothers right down in this area. Once we go inside. Alright, yeah, we've got some stuff down there as well, but I'm not worried about it. I've got some wolves, it looks like. I'm just gonna kind of avoid those guys for now. Let's go ahead and start crouching, just in case anyone is in here. You never know. What? What are you going about? Oh yeah, and then uh, quiet spell casting is another thing that I really want. Honestly, ooh, dwarfin metal ingot, that's nice. Honeycomb, a little bit heavy, but it's fine. Uh, yeah, we might have to offload some stuff to Lydia. I'm gonna go ahead and give her the. Um, here. How can I serve you, my thing? Uh, lots of ways. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and give her the bones. Cause those weigh the most. Uh, we'll give her the hide as well, and the pelts. Anything else that I should, should give her for now? I think we're good, honestly. Expedition mana, sure, why not, sure, why not, <laughs> why not, why not? Um... Yeah, that'll be fine. All right, cool. We're good. You lead, I'll follow. Yeah, quiet casting. That's the other one. Is illusion. So, is it illusion that it is? Yes, silent to others. There we go. That's another one we really want to do. That's another one I was working on actually. I forgot about that. Uh, shoot. Yeah, I should have. I should have put the point that I just put in the uh, that other tree right here, because then I can get this one unlocked. But, oh well, that was my bad. I forgot about that. I forgot I was doing that from the previous point, uh, previous, oh, hello. Read Solus Journal. We tried to get through Glacier, uh, at the top, but we couldn't find any way into that town para tower parapet. Yag spotted in the glacial wall a, uh, and construction, a construction of a catwalk. Wow, this grammar's kind of bad. Uh, was finished just in time for a storm to hit. At first, we thought to wait it out, but it has only gotten worse. A shift in the glacier took out several of the new laborers. Sorry, it's better now. A, uh, sorry, I ordered everyone to quickly move as much of the supplies as we could into the fissure, and we managed to get most of it. One of the hands decided he wasn't going to listen and tried to make it out through the storm, but he got blown off the catwalk by the wind. Dang. Looks like we are all... Or we, or we are well and truly stuck in here, but for all that, I feel even more driven that I should be the one to uncover the mysteries of this ruin. I'm tired of all the credit for my work going to the mages or the legion. It will be my name that goes down in the history books for this discovery. Alright, that's it. Sola's journal. Alright, um, what else we got here? Cast iron pot I don't need or want. It's a little chest here that you can barely see. Definitely take that stuff. Another bed roll. We already slept, slept though just recently, so we're fine. Uh, ooh. This doesn't look like they're well and good, to be honest. <laughs> um, Alright. Oh, we got a loot, though. That's kind of cool. Empty wine bottle, more beds. 
uh, what is that? Kimar Vamidium. I don't think we've actually read this. Let me double check real fast now. One second, one second. Let me look it up real quick in my my thing. No, we have not. All right, let's do it. Uh, <clears throat> once again, pause to read. I'm actually going to be doing uh, reading these all out as well, separate from the shorts, kind of. In not too long from now, so that'll be nice as well. A lot of people have been requesting that, and uh, I completely understand. It's just I've been like, I didn't have as much time recently, so I was kind of doing this as like a temporary thing making all these into shorts and then from there we'll, <coughs> we'll do it. Where is he? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself. There he is. You always try to keep it for yourself. No, there's got to be more scuba. Shut up. Shut up. Don't lie to me, Jason. You hit it. You always try to steal. Alright, I wonder if they can hear me cast this from over here. There. Nope. I'm not sure. It doesn't seem like it though. Alright, yep, there was Jadar, I think it said. <clears throat> and he was talking to Jazar. So there you go. I feel like there's gonna be some enemies up here. Alright, we got the Dwarven Spiders. <laughs> uh, I do actually know that we need 10 cogs for a mission very, uh, much later <clears throat> for the College of Winterhold. Not that much later, actually, but if we go ahead and grab as many as we can now, we won't have to do it later, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Because it's a bit of a pain, to be honest, doing it. So I'd rather just go ahead and get them now. Alright, I think that's the way it wants us to go. I might be wrong. Or maybe not, actually. Hold on. Uh, we have Dwemer Inquiries. Let's go ahead and read that real fast. Volume 3. Once again, pause to read. Ooh, we got some Dwemer writing there, it looks like. Interesting. Alright, uh, research notes. Here we go. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and read this real fast. Research notes. If only Umani would have left one of these dwarven machine creatures intact for me to study. The fact that they almost killed those Kedjit brothers in the middle of the night doesn't mean we couldn't have found a way to disable one. We dragged some stuff in front of the pipes they came out of to stop them from coming back. They are simply fascinating. It is just as Kalsamo descri described in Dwarves Volume 2. Their appearance does, in fact, resemble that of an arachnid. I had thought that to be an embellishment given by his source. Uh, the inclusion of the soul gem unto the, into the design of the apparatus is quite remarkable. It could explain the focus for the light, lightning that he describes. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear to be the main power source for the apparatus, perhaps some sort of harmonic resonance with the energies contained in the soul gem to bring heat to a small boiler. Too early to say conclusively, that does raise the question of where they get the liquid for the boiler, however. Ha, huh, that was strange. I thought I just saw something moving beyond the barred door. It looked vaguely, vaguely humanoid. I wonder if it could be an undiscovered automaton. I'm going to move my bedroll down here to see if I can catch another glimpse of it. This is all so exciting. Uh-oh, that's always a good sign. Alright, uh, we got some oil and stuff. I'm actually going to go ahead and taste that real fast. Funnily enough. Um, there it is right here. So we can see. We oh. the magic. Alright, good to know. We already grabbed the stuff that we needed from that Dwarven Spider and that one. Uh, we do have these, like, oh, charcoal. We do have these, like, Soul Gem Fragments here, which are kind of cool. I guess I'll take one, maybe. Alright, Dwarves V2, here it is. Uh, I think we might have already read this. Let me double check. We have not? Okay. Alright, Dwarves Volume 2 by Calselmo. Once again, pause to read. Alright, there we go. And then I saw a chest right here. Ooh, light armor skill is pretty nice. What is my current another talus? Honestly, let's go ahead and equip this for now. That's nice and all, but uh, I think I think this one's gonna be better. Oh. All right. Got a dwarven spider here. Oh shoot! I picked up a 
picked up a basket. I don't want that. There we go. All right, nice. I'm gonna head over here real fast because I think this is the bonus area and not the actual way to go. Pretty sure it wants us to go that way, right? Yeah, I'm fairly certain. This is the place where Jazar and Jadar were. Oh, hello. Nice, got the sneak attack in. He didn't hear us. He never saw it coming. <laughs> Alright, illusion increase, always great. Let's keep it up. Nothing back here, right? No. Go ahead and take this. There's a pickaxe. Spin to Wimber Scrap Metal. I think we can actually turn this into into dwarven metal ingots so i'm gonna take some of it for now might be a mistake in terms of carry weight and stuff but yeah all right we got a chest in of kenareth increases your stamina point by 10 percent or 10 points rather Cre created potions are 12 percent more out powerful that's actually a super nice enchant that we can disenchant for that'll be really nice um looks like that's it we got some looks like some damage oh. someone did there anything down here. Oh, hello. Nice, we did actually get the sneak attack damage even though it almost saw us there. Another torch. Is this where it wants us to go? What? Who is this brother? Another of this wood skins looking for food? This one wasn't trapped with us. No. No. You must be the one who took my skooma. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, we got some decent amount of health, actually. Oh, he tried to use a potion there, but he didn't get it in time. <clears throat> I've done that before. Alright, um, grab whatever we can sell from him. We do have the Woodcutter's Axe, but that's not really what I want. I could give it to Lydia, I guess. I've got a saw here. That might be the way we're supposed to go, actually. So yeah, that was Jazar, and this is Jazar. Looks like he killed his friend. All right, Jazar's journal. Let's check it out. This one is at his wit's end. I signed Jadar and myself up for this expedition to try to get him clean of the skooma. I brought a small supply to try to bring him down slowly, but the storm has had us trapped in the glacier for weeks. The others have not yet caught on that one with fur should not shake so much from the cold. But I've run out of the little skooma I brought, and Jadar is getting pretty bad. He's started hallucinating creatures coming out of the ice and the ruins. The others are starting to think he may be behind Valier's disappearance, but I know he would never do something like that. Interesting. It looks like he ended- oh, okay. Got a bunch of empty skooma bottles. And a healing potion, another woodcutter axe. Alright. Cure to these. Ooh, that's super useful, actually. And one of strength as well. Alright, well, uh, I feel like this is the way it wants us to go, actually, which I thought the other way was. So let me double check that other way real fast. Is it this way? Yeah. Let's check through here real quick. Uh, how do we get through here, though? Or maybe this is the way out. It might be the way out, actually. I don't see any, like, buttons or levers, really. Yeah, this is probably just the way out, then. Alright, might be, might be. Well, at least we tried. Uh, Dwarven Evergreens Volume 1. Oh, I didn't even see this one. Interesting. Oh, we have already read this, actually. No, we're good, we're good. Alright, cool. Well, then. Let's uh, let's continue on our way then. <laughs> Sorry, I thought we could open that that those bars, but evidently not. That's all right. Oh wow, I didn't even realize how long this recording's already been. Thirty minutes. Um, right now I'm a little bit low on recordings, and uh, if something comes up, I want to be like, I want to have some stuff in the backlog just in case. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and stop this one, and we will uh, continue on in the next part. Thank you guys for watching, I really do appreciate it, and I'll catch you there. Peace.